guys, welcome to the Bruce D. Nesbitt African American Cultural Center. I'm Angelita Calhoun. I'm a senior here majoring in Learning and Education Studies with a concentration in Education Equality and Cultural Understanding. Here is our main lounge areas where a lot of students come to just study and hang out mostly. Um, we have two TVs here. One is where we mostly listen to music or watch TV. We have the same TV show that we're all interested in. And the other is for like our announcements, for our um, affiliate organizations. And we also post like our Food for the Soul announcement, which we host at the center every Wednesday at 1 p.m. This here is our basement floor. And here we have our WBML, which used to stand for where black music lives, but it now stands for where black media lives. Um, it's for like anybody to just explore all types of media, whether like podcasts, music interests, DJing. Over here we have our dance studio. Um, which is mostly used for yoga. We have Afro Flow Yoga in this room here. Um, as you can see, we have like the mats and we have a speaker, a TV, just so people can like, if they want to do yoga, they can listen to music about doing yoga. If they want to dance, they have the space and the sound to do things like that. This here is our second lounge area, which is on the second floor. It's where it's more of a quiet area. Students can like actually engage in their studies. We have computers over here. It's also like a place for like a lot of group studying as well. This here is our conference studio. A lot of students come to do mostly study groups. If a department on campus has a meeting, sometimes they use this space as well. Over here, um, these are our RSO offices. Um, I, I keep mentioning our affiliate organizations, and you can see some on this wall right here. But this is the space that we um, use, like the um, offices of the affiliate organizations can use this space to come together and meet privately. This suite here specifically is where I work the most um, as an intern for 100 Strong. We oftentimes get our planning meetings here. This one right here is our administrative suite. This is where um, our director, assistant director, and our office assistant works. If you guys would ever like to meet any of these staff members, this is where they are located. Um, this here is our multi-purpose room. Hence the name multi-purpose. You can literally do anything in this room. This room is for social events. It can be rearranged in different types of ways. It's a multi-purpose room. It can be used for literally anything. This here is our kitchen area. Um, as I mentioned, food for the soul. This is where we serve the food, actually. Um, a lot of students can come in here and cook if they just reserve the room. Another organization, Men of Impact, uses this space for our midnight breakfast, which happens every semester on reading day. This center here is the fifth iteration of the Bruce D. Nesbitt African American Cultural Center. The first one was actually on this exact space. Although we moved around, we came back to our home. Also, you can notice the bricks on the outside wall. There are different shades that represent the different colors that black people come in.